blink. Blinks forward, an aggressive blink here. Of course, Stim will wear off, but uh, he actually gets away with these. <laughs> these must be the luckiest Marine and Marauder holding hands here, praying that they do not die to Stalkers. The drop here doing good damage on MC's third base, has to pull all the probes. Of course, all these Zealots and Stalkers will be able to pick it off. This Medivac days are short-lived. A lot of a lot of Stalkers waiting for them at the other edge of the map. This little ledge, I wonder if you can actually drop on this. Uh, quite useless, but good, would be nice to know. Uh, during that time, this small bio army is heading out through the map. A lot of Marauders in here, not many Marines. That third base is almost saturated now, two mules. Uh, General does have three mules, but he needs to save up for those scans if he wants to move out. Right now he has no scans, so if a DP goes in here, he can start wrecking havoc inside this army. Of course, no mobile detection for a General yet. A Ghost Academy going down, that will be useful to reveal DPs if he so needs to. Now one turret going up at the watchtower so general can actually fortify this position. One drop heading towards the third again. One small group of marine marauders just hanging out here just chilling in the middle of the map waiting for a DT to pick him off. That pylon still up for MC. Now both players have about <laughs> are going for half the map each. General throwing down his fourth base. Of course, MC already has his fourth base. MC is now maxed and throwing down a lot of cannons. This is what you want to do when you are a Protoss and maxed. You want to waste that money, not waste, but you want to spend that money on cannons. That way, it completely denies drops, and you can focus on doing things like picking off these small army groups here, blinking forward to pick them off. Very risky. A blink forward with these Marauders in back. But it paid off, he did not lose a single stalker here, though that is a lot of zealots, that's 24 zealots right there. With these sentries and stalkers will be very powerful if he decides to engage. This little drop was completely denied in the main, gonna try to drop that fourth base, but getting picked off by the stalkers before he can drop anything. One marauder was dropped, but instant, instantly taken out by that cannon. Now General dropping again, the third base, these drops are really not effective for General, he really needs to try and do something else here. MC's Harvester count is skyrocketing ahead, of course these uh, income tabs show that they are very close, that is because of the mule, but MC's tech will be very far ahead because he does have that 900 gas per minute instead of 650 for General, General going for that for fourth base of course MC does spot it now attacking the fourth of MC MC's his army is actually quite far back he will be able to pick off a few um, cannons here before MC get there but huge engagement general's army is split in half these charge lots will start hacking away of that army where are the high templars lagging behind once these storms come out it will be good game for general great EMP takes out all these <laughs> All these High Templars, they do not have any storms left. This small army will get picked off, but that EMP, well worth it for Gen General. <laughs> Getting almost all those High Templars, there's one that has a storm left. So no storms going down for MC. Of course, General did lose his entire army. We'll start to build it back up again. Two ghosts in here. Uh, will be able to EMP these sentries and hard templars. Of course, there is only one storm, but those force fields can be devastating. This uh, planetary fortress almost done here, but MC will pick it off before it can finish. And this fourth base completely denied. I believe Jinro is so far ahead right now. Uh, uh, MC is so far ahead right now. I mean. Um, he can actually engage this, split it in half with the sentries, and there's nothing General can do. Great EMP, taking off the shields off all those stalkers. Now Zealot's charging in, these Zealots really should be in front, that is what happens when you blink forward. These stalkers all in the red, uh, you can tell that blink has been researched. And these Zealots stuck in back, this is actually a great engagement from Jinro. Gonna Gonna wipe out this army, some stalkers blinking back, but these zealots will go down now, no more army. I take that back, <laughs> MC warping it about um, 
nine stalkers, three colossi, and a whole lot of high templars. He could actually warp those into archons, would be very effective against this very bunched up bio ball. Of course, he will use the storm and then morph them in. A lot more, nine more zealots warping in. Now, MC can push out, take this bio army out and rule the land. He is taking two more bases. He is taking this entire left side of the map here. And Jinro will try and attack. No, I don't think he knows about this base. He knows about the pylon here. He scans to take it out, but he does not see that there is actually a whole base here. He does now see it because of this marine. He will be elevating the, his forces up here. But MC's Snockers, uh, MC will sacrifice his base, there's no point in actually holding that, especially if you can't hold it effectively. Now we will wait and see what General will do to come back in this game. I don't believe there is anything he can do here. A huge number of Colossus out, there is 6 Colossus and no Vikings. So this will be lights out for General as soon as these two armies collide. He will see that huge number of Colossus and know they are not hallucinations. Uh, once this engagement takes place, I mean there are ghosts here but they won't do very much damage especially with all these High Templars in the back. This will be good game for General, expect a GG anytime soon. Now these Colossus using the low ground to actually harass the Supply Depot, not gonna pick it off. Uh, General during that time actually took this game out, but here it goes. He GG's out of there and MC takes the game. I hope you enjoyed it. I will be uploading more games in the near future, guys. Buddha, I'm out. Until next time.